Hello everyone, what I have here is a make block neuron which is a modular electronic design uh, blocks which can be connected together to form any electronic circuit. Each block comes pre-programmed and you can use it straight away by connecting them together. For example, I am using the funny touch uh, block which gives me four touch points that can be sensed by the, the block and then I can create a system where based on the touch I do something different. For example, I can detect and make the green touch as indicated by the green LED panel. I can have the red one, yellow one and of course the blue one. Now this simple circuit which has the ability to detect four different touch points can be programmed using mBlock5 software and convert it into a meaningful application for the real world. So let's see how we are going to do that. So I'm using the mBlock5 software. This is how it looks like. To work with the neurons, I need to add under the device category, the neurons. So I click on plus button, look for the neuron and once I select the neuron as device, it also changes the software blocks which is available for me to create my program. For example, in the sensing, I have funny touch, which can be used to detect any of this four wire touch. Here's the program that I have created. I'm using a forever loop and detecting those touch points. When it is touched, I do a specific action. To begin executing the program, I need to connect the neuron with the USB cable and I also click here on connect. The COM port is shown where I have connected the neuron board. Now the neuron board is connected. To run the program, all I need to do is click on this green flag button. So now it's running. Let's see how my circuit behaves now. So here's the circuit. In case of any emergency, the patient might be able to just touch the red button and that flashes that there is a medical emergency. I can also say that patient can inform if they want to go to the washroom or toilet. If the patient is hungry, they can simply touch and say, I want something to eat or drink. Also, when everything is fine, the patient might just want to indicate that I am fine and maybe whenever there is a free time, they want someone to come and just have a chit chat. So it's all okay. So as you can see how a small piece of electronics with little bit of code can be converted into something very meaningful, very useful in the real world. Thank you for watching.